Hey guys, so welcome to your general reading for um, Pisces. This is going to be for your January 2024. You can apply this to um, any of your placements. We're going to take a look and see what your life purpose is, okay? And then we'll finish off the read to see uh, what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Uh, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective, um, for the collective uh, Pisces people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, also um, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So, Pisces. What is Pisces' life purpose? Oh shoot. I dropped one. Hold on. What is Pisces' life, life purpose? Pisces' has life purpose for January 2024 for Pisces. Okay, so we have school. The answers that you are seeking involves going to school. Okay, maybe some of you guys are considering going back to school and learning something here. Okay, uh, some of you guys could be going through some sort of career shift, you know, um, you know, uh, but I do feel like you guys are definitely looking for something new, something that you know, aligns with you as a person here. Uh, maybe some of you guys are learning to be, uh, you know, maybe some of you guys are learning to be a teacher here. Okay, we have author here. You have a book inside of you that wishes to express and make time. To, maybe you guys are learning how to write or something like that. Yeah, or write better. Um, you know, some of you guys could be taking a writing class, okay? Some of you guys are maybe wanting to write novels or, uh, you know, books, you know, maybe memoirs or something like that. Uh, you know, interestingly enough, I, I, I do get the sense that, you know, some of you guys could be, you know, working with kind of like a writing coach here, kind of like a one-on-one -on -one sort of thing. I don't see it like as, as a class setting here, but, you know, I do feel like you guys are definitely, you know, going back to school, maybe taking a course, learning how to write better because maybe some of you guys want to write books, novels, maybe magazine articles or something like that, or write stuff on your blogs, okay? What else do we have here for Pisces? What else is Pisces? I need to know when it comes to their life's purpose here. We have the Knight of Swords here and the Emperor, Aries energy, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Yeah, I do feel like there's a sense of learning here. Yeah, there's a sense of learning here and that, that Pisces, you have new goals that you want to pursue here. And I feel like it's going to, uh, you know, I feel like you're going to stop at nothing to pursue this goal here. You know, that's uh, that's the emperor energy. That's that fire energy in the, uh, uh, with that uh, card here. And we have the high priestess, cancer, Pisces here, and the six of swords here. Yeah, so I feel like you feel like this is the right thing to do. Like your body is telling you that, okay, this is the right thing. Your soul is letting you know that this is the right thing to do here. The queen of pentacles. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and the King of Swords here, Libra. I feel like are this masculine energy here basically learning from somebody how to do this here, okay? So, you know, this is about writing better, you know, using proper grammar and stuff like that, sentence structure, paragraph structure, or something like that. And, you know, maybe you guys are learning, kind of like tuning up because you guys haven't been in school for a long time. You know, you guys maybe forgot how to write. I, I feel like sometimes that's like me. Yeah, I mean, it's been a long time since I've been in school. So, you know, so I feel like sometimes I kind of like forget like, okay, am I writing all this properly? Am I using the proper grammar? Am I spelling things correctly here? Knight of Swords here and the Ten of Pentacles, the Emperor here and the Lovers here. Okay. Your body is letting you know that this is the right thing. You sense that, you know, whatever you're putting out there, maybe these things could go right viral here. I do feel like you guys are going to make money here. Yeah, I do feel like you guys are going to make money here, some good money. Ten of Pentacles and the Lovers here, Gemini Energy, the High Priestess here, and the Moon, the Six of Swords here, and the Seven of Cups. It's definitely going to open up more opportunities here for you. 
some of you guys are seeing this in your dreams or that you're having visions about this. I mean, some of you guys could be doing like a podcast or something like that. Some of you guys could be doing like YouTube stuff, YouTube-y stuff here, okay? So, you know, or that you guys could be in this energy, you know, you guys could be reviewing books or something like that. Yeah, tell me about the Queen of Pentacles here. The Queen of Pentacles here and the Fool card. Tell me about the King of Swords. Why is the King of Swords here? And the Five of Swords here. Seems like there is a new beginning that's happening here. Seems like there is that energy of you like really wanting to go for what you want here and sort of like fighting for it, you, you know? Sort of fighting for it with this Five of Swords here. What else do we have here for Pisces? What else does Pisces need to know about for work on when it comes to the life purpose for January 2024 for Pisces? Okay, so we have the Judgment card and the Five of Cups. Judgment card and the Five of Cups here. Sagittarius energy, Eight of Cups and the Two of Swords. The Tower and the Seven of Pentacles. I do feel like moving forward, you guys will write something here. I do feel like there's, you guys are going to go through some ebbs and flows about, you know, creation here, creating something here. And I feel like, you know, you will re receive some sort of surprise here where maybe someone here is reaching out to you uh, like a publisher to help you pub publish your things or that you're going to be working with a publisher or something like that, okay? The Tower, Aries, Scorpio, Judgment, Sagittarius, Energy, the Three of Cups here, Five of Cups. I do feel like this is going to bring in some sort of joy for people here. Yeah, and I feel like it's going to bring in controversy too. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. I, 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 interestingly enough, I do feel like maybe the, like the stuff that you might be writing about has something to do with like like family drama and stuff like that. And I feel like this might bring up a lot of stuff for you and your family. And I feel like some of your family members might not be okay with this. Yeah, obviously, when you put something out on a public platform and people see it, you know, obviously, it's definitely going to create some contention. Yeah, so the King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and the Four of Wands here with the King to Queen of Pentacles here. Oh, uh, this is interesting. So you got, you know, some of you guys could be coupled up and both of you guys could have similar stories and that you guys are sharing your stories together here. Okay, tell me about the Tower here and the Wheel of Fortune here, the Seven of Pentacles here and the Eight of Wands. Yeah, there's something that's meant to happen here. And I feel like you're getting a lot of synchronicities about perhaps maybe pursuing this. Now, you could apply this to your own timeline. Maybe you guys haven't started yet, but maybe you guys are seeing a lot of signs here or that some of you guys have started it and you guys are just kind of moving forward with this, okay? But I feel like whatever this is, I feel like you're receiving a lot of synchronicity for confirmation to pursue this life purpose here, okay? So, yeah, so um, Pisces. I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.